We start with how a Newburg father now faces attempted murder charges. He's accused of shooting his three-year-old son in the head with a pellet rifle. Our Jacqueline Abad is digging deeper in this very disturbing case. She's live from McMinnville where he was just in court. Dan Elizabeth, yeah, very disturbing. Now that young boy is in the hospital after he was shot in the head. Deputies say that he was transferred to Legacy Emanuel Hospital, underwent surgery and is in serious condition. Today, his biological dad in court and he's being held on a, over $1 million. Now take a look. This is 46 year old Shane Raider. Yamhill County deputies responded to a call that a child was shot in rural Newburgh. They soon found out that he had taken off with his two kids in a van. Just minutes later, th 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 the three year old victim and his six year old brother were dropped off at an emergency room. Raider left them there, but was soon arrested about 10 minutes later. Investigators say he was involved in a domestic violence fight with the mother of his children and threatened to kill the family. He indicated his intent was to kill all of them. Um, so we are asking for increased security. Um, he has indicated he has a significant amount of funds um, in a, an account, um, and so we are asking for the $1 million bail on this particular case. He's facing 17 criminal charges, including attempted aggravated murder, burglary, and assault. Deputies say they are familiar with the home because he had been arrested for assault and violating a no contact order the night before the incident. Now, he was also arrested for endangering another person just last month. Raider will be back in court next Wednesday. Reporting live from McMinnville, Jacqueline Abad, Queen 6 News.